Please rise for the pledges and our creed. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to thee, Texas, one state under God, one and indivisible. I am YWLA. I am a scholar. I am a leader. I am a young woman. Respecting myself, my family, my peers, my community. My image is of integrity, the portrait of pride. I hope, I dream, I believe. Maintaining the discipline to succeed and the courage to fail, I am. You, you are, we are, the YWLA. Good morning, Young Women's Leadership Academy. This is Ms. Burns, your principal, and I'm bringing you announcements on Wednesday, May the 11th. For some of you, it's an A-Day, so after advisory, you're going to go to your first, second, third, and fourth period classes. If you are an eighth grader, eighth graders, today is your first star test of the school year. I've been telling you all along, they'll be here before you know it, and eighth graders, here we are. So number one, be sure you know where to go before you leave advisory, because everybody, we have a shortened advisory today, so at 9-10, you're going to be dismissed to go to your various locations. Eighth graders, be sure you know where to go for testing. Sixth and seventh graders, today and tomorrow, you're going to be doing some star boot camp activities and you're going to start in different teachers' classrooms. Sixth and seventh graders, be sure your advisory teacher tells you where to go after you're dismissed from advisory at 9 10. Students, be sure you know where, to, where you're going. High schoolers, I have some of you who are taking AP tests today. I have some of you who are on a regular schedule today. I have some of you who are on regular schedule, but different room today, depending on if your room is used for testing. High schoolers, be sure your advisory teacher tells you what to do today. Whatever it is, it's going to be amazing. Good luck to all my testers today. As we wrap up the testing part of video announcements, students, I have a couple more things to share with you. Let's talk about phones for a second. Students, remember, it is GPISD policy as well as YWLA policy, but it's GPISD policy that your phone is put away when you're in the building. Now, once you're dismissed, you're welcome to take your phone out, communicate with parents, whatever you need to do. But students, remember, YWLA is a no phone zone. Now, if there's any type of emergency and you need to contact your family, tell your teacher, come find me, tell an administrator, come to the main office. You have tons of options, but students remember YWA is a no phone zone. And students along those lines, don't loan your phone and don't give your phone to another student. You don't know what they're going to do with it. You don't know if they're gonna drop it and break it. You don't know if they're gonna throw it across the field. Students, you never know. Do not give your phone to another student. Make sure it stays in your backpack. Make sure it stays put away. All right, now students, let's talk about fines because I have some of you who owe fines. Maybe it's for IDs, maybe it's for temporary, maybe you had to buy a new non-temporary ID, maybe it's iPad related, but students remember you have to pay those fines. If you owe fines, you can't participate in jeans days and dress up days that we do as a campus. Students, we have a jeans day coming up on Friday. If you owe fines, you can't participate in that jeans day. So students, guess what? Pay your fines and everything will be fine. All right, everybody. Those are all the announcements and information I have for you this morning. Advisory teachers, don't forget, 9-10 dismissal to students next location. Advisory teachers, be sure you let your students know where they need to go after they're dismissed. All right, everybody. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Good luck to all of my testers in the building. And everybody, I will see you in the hallways. Mm -hmm.